broadest of terms, it's been fantastic all round. It's been definitely a worthwhile experience and I'm very glad that I have taken part in this opportunity to surf all across South Africa, most definitely. Amazing, I really loved the trip. So we got to do so much surfing all the way through. It's really intense, made us improve loads and really quickly. Also we got to do a load of other stuff, so we did like the world's highest bungee jump, uh, bridge bungee. Three, two, one, bungee! Got a safari, saw loads of animals super up close, saw like a rhino right next to the car, elephants and everything like that, so that was, we were really lucky with that. To us, the whole six weeks was pretty awesome. Just travelling up from, from Musenberg up, up north of Durban, just seeing how everything changes, culture and scenery and temperature, wildlife, everything like that. It was all pretty, pretty cool. Fantastic working with Mikey because he's obviously the local hero of Jeffrey's Bay. Everyone knows him, he's the sort of local legend. Um, and just to make a board with him was, was a really good experience because he's obviously a complete expert. And uh, the boards he makes as well, they're very, they're kind of like classic cars, they're, you know, fine instruments. So it was really good to, to, to make, and just to be shown, you know, the whole process of making a surfboard. That was an amazing experience, yeah. That's kind of the thing I'm doing at uni. Obviously not exactly surfboards, but the whole process of technique and tools and stuff he uses is all pretty much what I'm going to do. So that's very interesting learning how he, how he uh, you know, uses those and his techniques and stuff. And it's a pretty unique experience. Obviously you can go and go and get anyone to shake a board, but you're actually working alongside him and he's a bit of a legend down here in Jeffrey's Bay. Also we got to do community work, so we helped out the, um, the kids in Miesenberg, the Waves of Change, to just uh, help them kind of have a good time surfing. They don't generally get to do, so it's quite nice to do that, seeing them having a good time. That was awesome. That was really good. They were getting up on pretty much everyone as well. So, yeah, quite pleased with that. And uh, I think they definitely enjoyed it as well, which is what it's all about. Absolutely. Stroke your cheetah was pretty awesome. That wasn't something you take a try I'd normally do, but that was a little extra, which is pretty, pretty nice. And then I'd just say, like, probably the last couple of days in Coffee Bay was a bit of a highlight. Uh, it's pretty wild waves, but literally in the middle of nowhere with just you surfing. So the surfing, uh, my highlight would be uh, Hewlett's in Cape St. Francis, because uh, that's where I got my wave of the trip. So that for me uh, was a highlight. And also um, probably the safari that we did towards the end of the trip, um, where we saw a lot more than we thought we would, including an elephant right in front of us on the road, almost charging us. So yeah, that was quite interesting, but yeah, definitely good fun. Also, our accommodation of food all the way through has been amazing. It's been really good fun. Hostels are really good fun, especially Jeffreys Bay. It's a really cool hospital, hostel, really good vibe and everything. Um, what else was going to talk about? Jay, what's happening, bro? I've been in ping pong, so he's going to go surf in his baggies, man. <laughs> <laughs> what's going on, Will? What's <laughs> Oh, wow. That's good.
Edward, how are you feeling, mate? Um, yeah, alright. It's got to be bigger, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what about you, sir, William? A few little jitters coming in there. Smash it. Toby, how do you see your jump going? Lekker bread soup, ways of cooking. Let's go, sir. Bread. Uh, what are the betties? Uh, what are the loops, sir? Oh, don't follow him. Don't follow him. He knows how to surf. Okay, guys, you need to paddle hard. <laughs> paddle hard. Harder.